Warning. This game is rated M for Mature. This game involves acts of a violent nature, sensitive topics around sexual themes, and a very annoying talking bear. Viewer discretion is advised. It's only a few days of spring break, summer, summer break left. Wow. Let's skip right into uh, next year. Uh, nothing for the shopping program yet, but instead I'm gonna save. To be completely honest with you, this is the saddest thing in the universe. Almost 10 days of basically nothing. And that's really depressing. Um, so, let me just double check. Hmm. Okay. The um the costume store gets um gets a few um gets their festival outfits, which is pretty cool. Um it would have been really nice if um the guys were also in also in Yukata, but like whatever. Uh shopping program. Okay, Genji Beetle. Also with two longevity pills. I'm going to be fill up on these at some point. Tiny Soul Tomatoes and Hiriana Cabbage. So we're just a straight vegetable, no seed. Um, that makes it useless, <laughs> to be completely honest with you. Because I already got so many tomatoes. The cabbages are useful. But they are not as useful as the game would like me to think. Would would want me to think. We're going to get the Genji Beetles because they're going to be more useful when it comes to fishing. Man, it just feels like 10 whole days of really scratchy throats with me right now. But uh, no, this is all of course on one night. Um... I'll get the daikon, because we're not filled up on that yet, but we'll leave the tomato seedling and see what happens. Um, I think the tomato seedling stays there, and if not, then I've been buying vegetables for nothing. Um, but you know, that's fine. Do you know what's the more annoying part about that whole thing? It means that I lost out on a whole week of uh, drinks. Wait, it comes out on the 24th, right? Yeah. Yeah, so in two days I'll be able to get it. So that's probably where I'm going to stop the recording. For today, at least. Um, you know, I kind of been thinking about a lot of this game. And... And one of the uh, things that I've been seriously thinking about when it comes to how this game works is that there is a distinct there's a distinct feeling throughout the entirety of the game in which you are basically recommended to not do everything per se but what they really want you to do is that they want you to do uh, very significant things on very significant days now that might sound like very vague but I, I'm trying to actually figure out what I'm actually trying to say but it's like at the end of the day, the way that this game goes, if you want 100%, is you don't do everything. You've got to figure out when to do anything. <laughs> oh, they finally caught the culprit. The whole town's buzzing about it. 
suppose the um, victim's family can finally find peace, but not if they're watching with all that malarkey on the news. That's just a one-way. That's a one-way trip to eternal despair. It's hard, but ain't nothing that those can bring those people back. Got some time? Get a small request if you're busy. Ever taken a walk around here at night? It's real nice in the day and all, but at night you get a real change of scenery. I enjoy it. There's no city lights. All the stores are closed. It's so quiet you can hear the river. Only problem is that you gotta watch your step so it's dark. You know. Or you're free of landing. I suppose um I could carry a flashlight, but kinda of ruins the atmosphere, you know. I think it might be alright if I had a lamp, but even that it would be a pain in the neck to hold. It's just the wind would blow it out. So I was thinking of an eternal lamp or something might be nice. Could find you one. You know where to find one? Are you serious? That would make me happy. I think uh you could bring one to me here. And I'll little something away for you in return. Sure. I always want to read that newspaper, but it's just never there. <sighs> I think I found another way that I'm not like my sister. This time I leave a leaf pochette. Sure, I'll find you one. Eh. Uh. Okay, so that's both of those down. So, because I got a lot of points with Chie, uh, hey, you're new here. Oh, wait, no, I, uh, talked to you last time. Okay, so take two on this whole day, kind of. Um, well, not... Well, half of it. I recorded most of it and then realized, wait a second, I missed something in my notes. I have to talk to this guy again. Oh, how goes the fishing? My only regret is that I never managed to catch that one fish. Hmm. Could this old man have written the Emma that the fox showed you? Seems like he wishes to see the guardian of, um, um, Shichiri Beach once. Oh? Are you going to catch the fish that even I could never? Hmm, well... Might have been fate that uh, led me to give you my fishing rod. Alright, I'll teach you everything I know. Finish the task I started. Uh... Ask about the Sea Guardian. Well, I've only seen it once with my own eyes when I was young. I felt a tremendous pull on the line and I wheeled it in with everything I had. The thing is... Not only was it huge, it had like this godlike aura about it. I fought and fought, but it got away. Maybe it was just toying with me. But I came away thinking only one thing. I want to recapture that excitement. I need to catch that fish. But after that, I fished whenever I had the time. But now I'm old and not what I once was. I can't do that anymore. Just once I wish to see that fish before I die. Uh, any tips on the Sea Guardian? Well, that's a tough question. Luck is pretty important, but it's true that you'll be luckier than others on some days than, not, than on some days. Like I said before, the key to fishing on days when the water level rises. But never mind that. I'm going to teach you the ultimate technique. Now listen close, boy. I came up with this many years ago after, of research. I don't want you going and telling anyone else. Before the fish takes the bait. It will always poke at it first. The bigger the fish, the bigger the ripples. So when that happens, you pull out the line when the fish is poking at it. Simple. Fish will run off, and the bait will still be there. This is uh, basically what I found out uh, trying to catch the uh, river guardian. So if the ripples don't seem right for the kind of fish you're after, well, I suppose I don't need to finish that one, do I? Any tips about bait? Hmm, that's a good question. Uh, what was 
What was the thing? What was it again? It slipped my mind. It's a big round one, though. I know that. It's the only bait I'll take. It's only I can remember the name. That is called the Genji Beetle. The Genji Beetle does not spawn until you talk to him about that. I was trying for three hours. I was trying for three hours to catch a fish that hadn't unlocked yet. Sorry, catch a beetle that wasn't unlocked yet. And I feel incredibly stupid. <laughs> so I'm gonna go over here, gonna save. This time, I'm gonna try to catch the beetle. Apparently it can only be caught during the night, but for some reason, it in my notes it also says it can be caught during the day. Not too sure about that, but I'm gonna try a few times. I still have to get those sodas. Because I had to restart my entire my save file from the festival save file, which is kind of annoying. Just saying. Um. Okay, so it's been several days. I have recorded other things. I walked down to the store to not be so lazy. I came back with a uh, cookies and cream parfait. Did you know that parfait had an eye in it? Like, it makes sense, because it's a French word, but for some reason I just didn't know that. Um... Uh, the levels are out of, uh... I accidentally I clicked on this twice in a row. And I went like, ah, oh, it should be fine. But then both of them were... Uh, won the lottery, so I got upset, and then I just kept it. Um, so yeah, let's talk to Chie. Yo, know, Alan Kuhn? Uh, feels kind of weird meeting you on a day off. Oh, I almost got my license. Uh, I felt like Yus Yosuke kind of dragged us into this, but once I took my scooter for a ride, I realized how much fun it was. Can't wait to go to the beach with you guys. Yep. Then you want to train? Yeah, let's go! Yeah, sure. Oh, man. I suddenly am in the mood to record so much more than just this game? You have no idea. Okay, Chinese diner. You finished the day's training and decided to stop by with Chie. Today is steak bowl day! Just you wait! I don't have any more. Don't tell me they're at it again! Let's go! Oh, it's gonna be the friend. Oh, I guess not. What are you up to? Huh? Oh, not her again. <laughs> I know how to handle this bitch. <laughs> you look like you got something planned. Help! Hear that, Chie Chan? He wants help. How do you know my name? We ran into the guy you saved last time. Had a friendly conversation. He told us all kinds of stuff, like where you live and about that precious Yukiko san of yours. What are you trying to pull? Oh, I'm just gonna have a little chat with this kid. Stay put, okay? Cause who knows what'll happen to Yukiko-san if you get in our way. Ah, <laughs> man, that's nasty. You know, the uh, the lore that he's threatening Yukiko, and I'm her boyfriend standing right here. I was like, hmm. Mm, that's probably not a that's probably not a good idea, guys. Why you <laughs> Things are not looking so good. Uh Yeah, we can't let these guys get away. You sure about that? So you don't care what happens to your loved ones? Then hit me! You're pissed at me, right? Then why don't you just take a swing at me? I won't fight back! Be my guest! The face, the gut, just pick a target! As hard as you want! Come on! Freak. What's with this bitch? She for real? Whatever, man. Let's go! Miss? Thank you. Huh? Oh, 
No, don't worry about it. The child ran off. <sighs> My heart's still pounding. You would not believe how many times fights have been broken up because one of the people that are about to fight actually looks like that they're ready to to not only throw a punch but also willing to take it. Uh, <laughs> I have seen this a lot. Uh, I do not get into fights, uh, but I have uh, finished several of them, let's just say. Um, it's just really fascinating that it's just like, hey, uh, hey, we're gonna hurt people. I was like, okay, then hurt me. Nah. It's like, then you weren't planning on hurting anyone, dude. <laughs> Was that stupid of me? Eh, probably. Uh, at least you, pr you protected that kid, so. Thanks. It might have been stupid, but I wanted to save them. Well, I mean, isn't that... Wasn't that your goal this whole time? Why you've been getting stronger? That kid? Yukiko? How I feel about this isn't fake. I really want to protect them. Feel like your relationship has grown deeper? You have now reached rank 9. Meaning that it is now time for me to let her down and tell her that I'm dating her best friend. Take a mobile blow, yeah? Uh, um, well, I also want to protect you. Uh, well, you are you might a... might be a little flaky, and maybe you don't even need protecting. Uh, you don't have that good of a heal, and most of your, most of your utility was AoE physical damage, so... But I, I want to protect you. Don't worry, you're gonna be- you're gonna be like a B member of the team for a long time. You were already in a relationship with another girl. What will you do? Don't worry, Che. I'm counting on you to be a more useful team member than Yosuke. Yep, I'm counting on you. So, let's have some steak! Sure, why not. Welcome back. Hey, Dojima. Uh, just the person I was looking for. Um, apparently today we're going to be uh, spending to, uh, s spending some time with uh, with Dojima. I'm actually just cut some of that out. But um, either way, we need to catch a very specific bug tonight. Chopsticks, Tisho Papri. Is this some kind of secret code? Huh. Well, either way, um, we're gonna be catching some bugs, so let me do that right now. Oh, it's you! Uh, thanks for that last time. I'm sorting out some of the leftover models now that the store's closed. Do you want another one? I know you all at least put it together, so you can have one for free if you want. Sure. Oh, when you're done working on the one that you're currently working on, then I'll I'll give you this one. So let me know when you get back later. Oh, okay. So that's where we get new ones. I didn't actually know. Okay, it was just that easy. So it turns out... Um, I'm probably going to take both of my different versions of my recordings and just uh, kind of fit them together. So it's like, okay. So it turns out that I really did need to talk to the fisherman guy to unlock Genji beetles from showing up. That's the reason why I wasn't seeing them for like three hours, me even trying that. Okay. So I need to catch uh, Genji beetles. And Inaba beetles, in case I actually wanted to get any more of the uh, river guardian. But now I'm going after the sea guardian, which takes the Genji beetles. And just like with the uh, 
way I was getting the guardians, I have to... I have to wait for the correct... There you go. I have to call- I have to get the right type of beetle, use it when it's raining, and just keep resetting it until I, uh, until I find the right one. Right one. There we go. Huh? What am I doing out here? Go back home. Okay. So, the last thing that we're gonna be doing today- just pop my notes because I was- Watching a live stream without sound. Um, is we're gonna just be spending time with uh, is we're gonna be spending time with uh, Dojima. Uh, I'm gonna just make sure that I have hero font. There we go. Because it's always important to have the uh, right persona. Hey. Hey. Oh yeah, because this is just a spending time, there isn't going to be too- Oh! Got a message. Uh... So yeah, I'll- I'll just say it right now. Um... Like and comment on the video. I always like hearing what you think about the uh, current stuff that is going on in the game. Um, there's a bunch of links below to several of the things I'm doing. I- promised like a few days ago that I was going to stream and I never ended up doing it. So I'm probably going to do it after I finish recording the batch of episodes today. Um, while I wait for my food to show up. Um, that's, uh, that's about it. See you guys tomorrow. Ah. Uh.